Good morning. This video is to show how easy it is to create a marquee or ticker tape display. A marquee is a simple package for showing text messages in a scrolling panel across the screen. So let's create one, starting with a bare or empty project. So first we will import the package. Normally you would do this from the asset store, but because I have a local copy, that's what I will import. So creating a marquee is as simple as using a asset menu item create marquee and we'll give it a name as you see I'm using the names interchangeably so firstly if you look at the scene you will see that it's added two main game objects the game custom asset managers is just to ensure that the custom assets are loaded that we need, in this case the ticker tape. The real work is in the marquee canvas where it has a marquee with the script attached and the attached script has a set of variables already in it for characters per second, how often you repeat, what is showing right now and a trigger for when showing is complete. The text object underneath is as you would expect in any other unit. However, it uses the standard text. If you want to use Text Mesh Pro, just remove that item and add in Text Mesh Pro. This textual game um, component is the communication to change the text. So it will work with either approach. Going back down into the project, my ticker tape was the name we used. It's given you a set of quotes in case you'd like to use them. And each of those game objects you saw before are sitting in here. The easiest way to edit them is to go to the ticker tape manager and they're all available there. So turn off auto start if you don't want messages coming up immediately. You can define how many seconds between feeds so you can have them coming up once a minute if you like. The quotes is the most important one as it, has, it contains any automated text you want to come out. So we have elements directly in the quotes. We can put them there. They're just text or files, which are text assets on disk or in the project. The next two don't have any setup that's needed. Showing is what is showing right now. Obviously, it's not having anything in it just yet. It is useful because if you take that custom asset and put it into one of your own texts or create a reference, by changing that text, it will immediately display on the screen. This is the easiest way to drop in uh, a news item or a warning. And the trigger says when showing is complete. That's just useful. It actually communicates between the ticker tape and the marquee, but you could use it also to see when a display was done. You just register it. Okay, this should be just as easy to just run. So you'll notice that it, nothing came up but it did give us the marquee screen here so we can change things. So let's add an element. Oh, I want some lowercase. But Spain is in uppercase. Oh, blow it. Let's add a second one.
That's enough, I think. If I say cycle, if at the moment it'll choose them randomly. If I say cycle, they will always be in order. If it's exhausted below 10, then even though it's random, it won't repeat until it's finished the two. And the same goes for anything in the quote files. Oh, and what we'll do is we'll add a, an attribution here, because that's useful to know about too. Right, done. To run it, we need a slightly larger display. That's one, and that's two. Notice that the attribution stands out as being different, and it quotes the original text. If we look at the now showing, you'll see that that's the, the text that's, that's going to be set up. So there we go there. This case it was a different random order which reversed it, but it waited until all were done first. And you need not use prepackaged messages. Just clear the entries from the quotes custom asset and display the messages interactively. This will be a reference to the same custom asset as used by the marquee. You would use the inspector to reference it, add the reference. Health is a custom asset from with an emitter that fires whenever the value changes. There's our subscription. And that's it. Simple, isn't it?